Okay, so another method that we have for solving integrals is substitution rule. This is most of the time called the u substitution because we use u, the letter u, in order to substitute for the function and to see if we can find the integral of that particular function. So when do we exactly use u substitution? Well, integration by substitution or u substitution is a method of integration that is used when an integral contains some function and it is derivative. So when you have a function, sometimes or most of the time, it looks very, very hairy and complicated it you say oh my god I cannot solve this but if you look closely that function might include its derivative and when it does you know that right away you use the u substitution so how does it work well let me show you in an example let's say we have this example we want to find the integral of 2x plus 2 times e to the x squared plus 2x this looks hairy and nasty but if you look closely, this function that we have right here, x squared plus 2x, if you take the derivative, it becomes 2x plus 2. This is the derivative of this function. When you have something like that, it is a ring. Right away, you know that you can use u substitution. So how do we use u substitution? Well, you substitute u for this function. So you say that u equals x squared plus 2x, and you take the derivative of u. You know that the derivative of u, meaning that du dx of u, u is 2x plus 2. So du dx of u is 2x plus 2. Okay, so why do we go through this trouble? Well, I'll tell you in a second. This du of dx can be looked at as a fraction. So du over dx equals 2x plus 2 and du only equals 2x plus 2 d x this is very very important because du equals 2x plus 2 dx right here we have 2x plus 2 times e to the x squared plus 2x times this dx this dx and this 2x plus 2 can be thought of as du we'll substitute them for du and this e will remain however this x squared plus 2x will be substituted for the u so this entire ugly function will be changed into something like that will be changed to e to the u du you see how simple this is this is very very simple and we know right away what is the result of that or how do we solve that but when it was like this it was hairy and we couldn't do anything or we couldn't do much to it so what is the integral of e to the u du if you think about it this du is 2x plus 2 dx which is which we have it right here is 2x plus 2 dx it is this one and that one this u is x squared plus 2x it is this one so what is the integral of e to the u du well this is just eu because the integral of eu is eu and the derivative of eu is just eu so the integral of e to the u du is just eu and we know that u is x squared plus 2x so we have to substitute it back we have to change this u to its original form what we get is e to the x squared plus 2 x we just substitute the u for x squared plus 2 x so this is basically the u substitution you see if there is a function and its derivative if there is you assign u to the function and you find the derivative of that function you assign the derivative of that function to the du and you proceed to find the integral and eventually you get this form but don't forget i used to make that mistake a lot when i was in school when you find the integral and it becomes on this form usually forget that to change this u back to its original original form please don't forget that when you have a u please always remember that to change it back to its x form in order to get full mark so the integral of 2x plus 2 times e to the x squared plus 2x is just e to the x squared plus 2x let me give you another example let's say we have 2x over x squared plus 4 dx what is the integral of this well i'll pause the video to think about it if you can see a function and its derivative Welcome back. Yes, there is a function and it is derivative. The function is we will assign u to the x squared plus 4. When we take the derivative, it becomes 2x. And that's exactly what we have on top. We have 2x on top. On bottom, we have x squared plus 4. So du dx equals 2x. However, only du equals 2x dx. So this function right here becomes the integral of 1 over u du. And we know that the integral of 1 over u du is just natural log of absolute value of u. And don't forget, we have a constant right here. But I'm not writing for simplicity. So it becomes natural log of u. And natural log of u is natural log of x squared plus 4. 4 because u equals x squared plus 4 so the integral of 2x over x squared plus 4 dx equals natural log of x squared plus 4 and how did we do it we did it by u substitution we saw that there's a function and its derivative we substituted the function for u 
and its derivative for du. We solved the integral for u, and eventually we substituted back the x function into the u. Let me give you the last example. Let's say we have this function x to the third plus one over x to the fourth plus four x dx. This sounds very, very ugly and nasty, but again, it is very, very simple. We assign u to x to the fourth plus four x du dx of this is 4x to the third plus 4 and du equals or du over 4 equals x to the third plus 1 dx because this 4 if you divide everything here by 4 it becomes du over 4 dx if you multiply everything by dx it becomes du over 4 equals x to the third plus 1 dx so let's substitute everything into this equation so the integral becomes 1 over 4u du why because here this is u and if we forget about this it becomes the integral of 1 over u dx times x to the third plus 1 right here equals du over 4 or 1 over 4 times du 1 over 4 times du times u becomes 1 over 4u times du so what is the integral of this well this equals 1 over 4 the integral of 1 over u du and this is just 1 over 4 ln of u which is equal to 1 over 4 times natural log of x to the fourth plus 4 x so the integral of x to the third plus 1 over x to the fourth plus 4 x dx equals natural log of x to the fourth plus 4 x over 4 and how do we do it we did it by u substitution we substituted x to the 4 plus 4 x by u and du dx of this is 4 times x to the third plus 1 and only du equals 4 times x to the third plus 1 dx or du over 4 equals x to the third plus 1 dx. When we substitute everything back into this equation, we get this function. So, and don't forget we have a plus constant right here. So this is basically the u-substitution. Integration by substitution or u-substitution is a method of integration that is used when an integral contains some function and it is derivative. When it does, you know right away that you can use u-substitution and please don't forget to change the u back to the fx form to get full credit. So this is about this method of integration.